Today for CMA at home, we're gonna make invisible ink. All right guys, for our invisible ink, what you're gonna need is a small dish, some lemon juice. If you don't have one of these, you can just take a lemon and squeeze it into here. A piece of paper, a Q-tip, and a hair dryer. Now the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take our lemon, we're gonna open it up, and we're gonna squeeze the lemon juice, you don't need a lot, into the bowl. All right, now with your Q-tip, you're gonna dip it into the lemon juice, and you're going to write on your piece of paper. All right, now we wait for it to dry. All right, after your paper is dry, you're gonna take your hair dryer and you're gonna put it on the high heat mode. Make sure it's on heat. And you're gonna turn it on. And run it over your paper. All right, my friends, so my hair dryer wasn't hot enough, so I'm going to try with a candle. I know I'm holding it with tongs and you need an adult to do this. Look at that, look what's happening. So what happened? Our letters turned brown, right? That's because our lemon juice oxidized. When it was exposed to heat, it turned brown. Now this can also happen with other liquids like milk and orange juice. Isn't this cool?